Hey West Ottawa, Monty here. We have some great resources here at West Ottawa. One of those resources is the library. A big problem at West Ottawa is tardies. Hey guys, check out this new music I got. It's pretty sweet. Hey West Ottawa, if you didn't know, our tennis team is insanely good. A big problem at West Ottawa is tardies. What is a tardy? A tardy is being delayed beyond the expected time. A big part of tardies here at West Ottawa is the North security team. I decided to go interview them and see what they had to say. So why are tardies bad? Like, why do you guys really like push tardies? That's an excellent question. Tardies correlate into the real world, as in, if you're late to class, and that's a pattern you start developing in school, that's something that eventually develop into a profession. But we all know if we're late to work, we get fired. We want to instill that in our students very early. And so, what are some of the newer policies that we have this year at Woke that like, you are pushing with tardies? That's an excellent question. What we're doing instead of our traditional tardy sweep last year, is we're going to do our mini sweeps, or hall sweeps. Essentially what that means is, is that random hallways during the day, during passing, will be targeted by the North Security Action Team. What we'll be doing is stationing ourselves, and any student found in the hallway after the last bell rings will be dealt with severely. With a detention. Awesome. Thank you so much. Thank you. Hey West Ottawa, as you can see, there's a lot of snow and it's pretty cold out. Be sure to wear some nice gloves, maybe a hat if you have to walk between buildings, bring a jacket. Back to you in the studio. Hey West Ottawa, Monty here, and just reminding you that the weather is getting a little bit colder, so dress right. Be sure to wear a jacket, maybe some sweatpants. Be comfortable, but also be warm. Back to you in the studio. Up to the elementary schools to give all these coats away and Harbor Lights. Leg one, leg one, leg one, leg one. I decided to investigate. At the library here at West Ottawa, you can check out a plethora of books of any genre. You can go on the computers and look up anything you need to, whether it's research for a project or just leisurely fun. You can even make copies. 
here with Miss Johnson, the librarian here at West Ottawa. And Miss Johnson, in your experience compared to other schools, how does West Ottawa's library compare? Oh, West Ottawa's libraries are great. We've had good funding for our libraries over time, so we're able to have developed really nice collections. And we have much better staffing here at the high school than many high schools do. So um, we're very fortunate here. Yeah, definitely. Um, how many books exactly do we have? Well, it depends on the building. The North Library, I, I just checked, the North Library has 19,550 different titles. Wow. But we have 21,268 copies, some okay. of those popular things we have more than one right. copy of. And South, which uh, is the library that has the main collection from when the original high school building over on 136th Street has 29,638 wow. different titles with 30,702 copies. That's awesome. Yeah, so it's great, great stuff to read, and we can always help you find things um, like checking with Herrick and things like that if we don't happen to have something that you're looking for. So do come in. Uh, we also have lots of databases for you to use. Find lots of good, reliable articles for your, for your research, for your papers and all. And you can have access to those at home, too. So just come in, and we can show you how to do that if you have questions. Great. Thank you so much. As you can see, West Ottawa, our library is a great resource that you can use at any time. Be sure to stop by, maybe check out a couple books, use computers if you need to, maybe make a couple copies. Back to you in the studio. Hey, guys, check out this new music I got. It's pretty sweet. Hey, can you turn that down? Why? Because one of the 16s have hearing loss. Yeah, it's irreversible. What? Remember, never play your music too loud. You don't want to be that teen that can't hear. Hey West Ottawa, if you didn't know, our tennis team is insanely good, so I decided to go interview a couple people and see how their season's going so far. Let's go check it out. Here with Joe Miller, he is on the varsity tennis team. Joe, how many years have you been on the varsity tennis team? Um, I've been on varsity tennis for four years. And in your four years, has this been your favorite slash most successful year? Um, yeah, I think our team's definitely been the most successful. Um, definitely have the potential to do the best that we've done in a while. What comes next? What's after conference for you? Next we have regionals, and then the following weekend we'll have states if we place in the top two at regionals. All right. Good luck, Joe. Thank you. Here with the Nick Schnobel. Uh, Nick, how many years have you been on varsity tennis? All four years. Yeah, and uh, what position are you in tennis? Like, uh, I have one singles. One singles. One and singles. Um, do you wish to pursue tennis into college? Yeah, I'm uh, talking to a couple D1 schools. and. Uh, Hopefully, hopefully that uh, all ends up right. Great. Uh, how's this year going so far for you? Pretty good. I only have a couple losses, um, and I'm looking to go into state hot, and <laughs> we'll see. We'll see how I do. Hopefully, make it to the semifinals in my draw. Great. Um, biggest competitor you have? Biggest competitor. Um, in the conference is Granville. 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 And is that as a team or is that individual? Um, both. 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 Okay. All right. Great. Thank you. See the assembly? That's today? No. It's weird. Gonna go quick. What time was that again? Uh, ten minutes ago ten, or something like that? Ten minutes ago. Hit
you hallelujah. Girl sent you hallelujah. Girl sent you hallelujah. Come on. Come on, we got to go. Try it, try it. Drop. Come on. Cause I'm down from Saturday night and we in the spot. Don't believe me, just watch. So proudly we held at the twilight's last gleaming. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, in the visible, with liberty and justice for all. Ottawa. I'm Brent. And I am Mott. Let's get this show on the road. That's a good call. WBN starts now. Senior pictures and yearbook orders are due with payment to Mr. Drenick this Friday, October 10th. Thank you, Nick. What are you guys doing? She's practicing for her senior pictures. Duh, they're due on Friday, October 10th. Make sure to get your senior pictures in. West Ottawa Science Olympiad, or WOSO, will be having an informational meeting after school on Wednesday, October 8th, and again on Thursday, October 9th. These will happen in Mr. Meyer's room in South, room 109. All students interested in being a part of WOSO this year are invited to attend one of those meetings. If you cannot attend either of those dates, please swing by Mr. Meyer's room at some point in the week and get forms and, and information. It looks like Lucretia and Michaela have a nice Start Smart video for you. Let's check it out. This, the next Young Republicans meeting will be Tuesday, October 14th at 7 a.m. in Mr. Van Zandt's room. We will be voting for officer positions. Donuts will be provided. Contact McKenna Stam with any questions. Remember to bring a quarter on Thursday. The West Ottawa staff will, members will be selling the first issue of the school newspaper. This issue includes a tribute to Johnny Bracamontes, an introduction to Woe's newest club, Woe Pong, and an editorial arguing that John Green's books follow a simple formula. Any girls interested in playing lacrosse this spring must sign up in the athletic office this week. There will be an activity showcase this Thursday, October 9th, during both lunches in both buildings. Please stop by and check out the clubs and organizations that will be on display to see how you can get more involved. We have more college visits for you. October 8th, Spring Arbor at 10, and then Friday, Grace Bible College, on October 13th, Michigan State will be visiting at 12.30. Kuiper College will be here at 9, and Oakland will be here at 1.40 on the 14th. The 15th, Alma College will be here at 9.30. The final visit of that week will be Grand Valley State at 8.45 on the 16th. On October 20th, 20th Western Michigan University will be doing on-site admissions, which are available by appointment only. See your counselor for more information. The National Art Honor Society, NAHS, will meet for the first time on Thursday, October 9, in Mr. Kelly's art studio from 5 till 6. NAHS is an after-school student-led art club. Any interested students should plan on attending to see Mr. Kelly if you have any questions. Well, West Ottawa, it looks like all the news has gone away. Looks like it, Mont. See you tomorrow at 745. Flow crazy, celebrating the madness. I never thought I would deliver no classics. Then I hooked up with them and they delivered no classics. Yeah, I be keeping it true. By the dawn, dirty laugh. What so proudly we held at the twilight's last gleaming. 
I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. What's up, Will? I'm Mott. And I'm Michaela. Looks like we have a great show for you today. Let's get it started. Attention National Honor Society members. The induction ceremony for new members is tomorrow, December 3rd. Arrive at the PAC by 6.30 if you are getting inducted and 6.45 if you are an existing member. Contact Mr. Taylor with any questions and remember to bring your t-shirt order form if interested. There will be a softball meeting on Thursday, December 4th in the LGI room from 3 to 3.30. Anyone interested in playing softball this year should plan to attend. See Coach Meyer if interested. Attention skiers and snowboarders, it is not too late to order a discounted ski card for Bittersweet. See the reception at either building to pick up your form. The cost is $15 and if you return it in by this Friday, you will be able to receive your card before winter break. Looks like Clutch made an awesome video. Let's check it out. Oh, hey West Ottawa. Happy month of caring. To start off month of caring, we're starting with our food drive. Right now, the seniors are in first place and the freshmen are in second. But then, the juniors and the sophomores are tied. So bring in your canned food by Friday, and at the holiday assembly, there'll be a special treat for the winning class. The Lip Dub is coming, West Ottawa. WOBNers will assign a specific part to you and your group. If you are not assigned to one of these parts, be sure to be in the gym for the very end of the Lip Dub. Remember, this year it is completely at North, so we would like full participation. Don't forget to follow at GoWo underscore college on Twitter and Instagram for college news, scholarship alerts, and more. Did you know West Ottawa is starting a mock trial team? See Miss Luna if you have any questions. Hey, Michaela, do you park your car in the student parking lot? Yeah, I actually do. Well, then you should watch this sweet video about it. Okay. Well, West Ottawa, that is how the cookie crumbles. Make it a good day, Will. We'll see you tomorrow. <laughs>